The cucamelon originates in Mexico, Colombia, and Central America. Now, for those of you who don't know, Central America is made up of Panama, Costa Rica, Nicaragua, Honduras, El Salvador, Guatemala, and Belize. Melothria scabra is the scientific name, and it belongs to the famous cucurbitaceae family, which includes such members as the pumpkin, cucumber, watermelon, and the cantaloupe. So despite popular belief, no, it is not a hybrid. It's not like a watermelon and a cucumber got together and did the nasty. That being said, the English word cucumelon is a mashup of the two, but it only came about in the 1980s. Outside tropical climates, these are often grown as annual plants, and they need full sun in order to bloom by the spring-summer season. This whole process usually takes about 60 to 70 days. Even though the cucumelon looks like a watermelon, it doesn't taste like one. No. Some people say it tastes like a lime-soaked cucumber. And on top of that, the skin is edible. So you could just pop the whole thing into your mouth and enjoy. Cucumelons are used in many dishes. Salads, salsa, you can pickle them, use them as a garnish for drinks. Fry them with some garlic and olive oil, cucumelons with baked potatoes in a bagra masala gravy. But let's talk about what's on the inside. That's so beautiful. In just 100 grams of cucumelon, you, yes you, will find 15 calories, one gram of fat, one gram of protein, one gram of fiber, and four grams of carbs. Cucumelons also contain vitamins C, E, and K. They've also got potassium, powerful antioxidants that include lycopene and beta carotene. And on top of all that, they may also help in boosting your immunity. Cucumelons are pretty cool. Well, that's all I have for you this week. Have you tried cucumelons before? What do you think? Do they taste like a cucumber soaked in lime? If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment below. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you always know when I upload new videos just like this. I gotta go try to find some cucumelons. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.